Good evening. Fort Wayne is calling in some outside experts to help come up with a way to improve our rivers. It's time now for the 2011 Rivers Summit. Lots of people spent a lot of time down by the water at Riverfest over the weekend, but without a boat of some sort, there is little anyone can actually do in the water, and that is one of the main goals of the summit, cleaning up the water. News Channel 15's Elizabeth Fields was at that summit at the Grand Wayne Center tonight, so Elizabeth, is there a plan? Well, Mark and Heather, there's the beginning of a plan. Small things we each can do, like picking up after our pets and limiting fertilizer on our yards. But for the rivers to get really clean, we're going to need the cooperation of towns upstream. Beautiful, green, quiet, an oasis. Probably not how most people describe our rivers, but river consultant Ann Coulter says we should. You have incredible resources in those rivers. First of all, you've got three of them. Most places, if they've got a river, they've got one. Coulter helped Chattanooga ramp up its riverfront. She says it's never too late to change things, even when it comes to our water quality. You can always turn things around. You have to have commitment. Of course, you've got to have commitment and partnerships upstream it's, if that's going to happen. But that's not a reason not to start using those rivers. One of the first things the consultant noticed is there's lots of ways over the water, but almost no way to get to the water. You can't get to them. Uh, that's part of the challenge. Uh, they can be incredible economic generators and still be beautiful, green, wonderful public places. Dan Weyer with the Friends of the River says that's what part of the money raised at Riverfest will go towards this year, cleaning up the banks and down the road, coming up with a complete waterfront plan. I think people want to be along the rivers, and once we provide them an opportunity to have access to the rivers, we're going to see that grow. Now, it seems like we just keep coming back to the water quality. Fort Wayne is already in the midst of a federally mandated $240 million project to do just that. But it won't be complete for more than a decade. And as for the River Summit, it's going to continue all day tomorrow. Okay, thank you.